Hello everyone, it's Grabs here, and today we're playing For Honor. Uh, this game is currently out in closed beta, and I've played a few matches, and can't say I'm the best at it, but uh, I'm trying. And speaking of the closed beta, uh, it runs for a couple more days, but I'll be, I have three keys to give away. So if you want one, you want to check it out uh, before it comes out. The game comes out on February 14th, I believe. And if you want to check it out, definitely stick around to the end of the video because I'll give details on how to uh, win one of those keys then. So I've played through maybe three or four matches so far, just getting, getting used to it. It does have quite complex battle styles in that it has directional blocking and uh, attacking and things like that, plus the mechanics of the game itself. It does borrow heavily from some MOBAs in the way, especially in the 4v4 Dominion mode. Um, you have uh, groups of soldiers and hero characters and you need to push up and capture points to win. Uh, once you capture a point, you then earn points and the first team to a thousand then wins. Uh, we're going to step into a 4v4 Dominion game just to check that out. Um, just give it a quick run. Um, I'll explain quickly how this how this map screen works here. As you can see, there's factions and there's territories per faction. So the idea is when you first start the game, you choose a faction with which to align to. Um, I chose the samurai because I love the idea of a samurai. Um, and in games, um, you the more you win, the more territory you, you earn. So as you can see, you know, the current colors that line up on the map um, you know, indicate which, which faction owns what, what land. So we're going to try and push up a bit for the samurai. So we're going to jump into 4v4 Dominion and see if we can find a game. There's a few people playing. It's been good. I have had a few connectivity issues here and there. It hasn't been perfect. I mean, it has dropped out a couple of times. I don't know if I can just attribute that to Australian internet, if anybody knows how bad that can be. <laughs> perfect, perfect example of why that happens right there. <laughs> All right, we're gonna step in and we'll try one more time. Let's see what we can get. All right, we've found a game. Let's see if we can actually seal the deal on this one and get in there. Good, success. That's not to say that it won't drop out still. Anyway, so each each team has has a hero types. So you have the Templar or Crusader, you have Vikings style or Samurai. As you can see, based on it being level four, I've played Samurai the most, or that's all I've played actually so far. Um, and within each of those groups, it has different types. So you have uh, a Vanguard, uh, Samurai has a hybrid, and an Assassin, whereas the other guys have heavy and the same too. Um, I'm going to jump in as a Samurai Vanguard. You have abilities here which you can customize. I haven't earned any more yet. Um, but uh, we'll jump in as it is. I'd hate to hold the game up. I think the idea of this game is cool in that it, it, it merges together, you know, warriors of different, of different lands. You got Vikings fighting alongside Samurai and all that. I think that's very cool. As you can see here, I'm quite low leveled in comparison. These guys, I don't know, seems all they've done is play this game. But uh, we'll see if we can hold our own. I'm not making any promises because it hasn't gone fantastically in the past, but let's see what happens. My tactic for the start of this game is going to be to jump in and just try and push back their soldiers as much as possible because I need to get those initial XP points so I can get levels up because when you level up you unlock abilities. Um, in particular my second level ability is what I'm pushing for because that allows me to rally troops and it can really turn the tide in a fight. Now, these maps have different styles as well like you can get this map in uh, you know during the day and everything's not you know muddy and ruined and stuff like that but um, we're gonna, we're gonna get to step in and see. So, I'm gonna try and take down as many of these guys as possible. There's a hero at the back. I'm gonna try and avoid him as much as we can. It's not going too well already. Pull back a bit. Hopefully, we can just... Right, we captured B. Now we just need to hold this. 
the longer we hold it, the more we can, the more we can get ahead early. So I've found is crucial so far to uh, winning games. Now we've got a guy here. Directional blocking is crucial, and he's dominating me. But we can we can hit him back. That's for sure. Okay. It's just a warm up. I mean, yeah, I got I got executed and my head got cut off, but you know it's fine. We'll take it in stride. We'll we'll keep going. It's all right. But the more times you die, as in most mobas, the longer your respawn is. So you have penalties, and because I was executed, it's an even longer penalty. So let's just keep going. We're already getting quite dominated at this point. But don't let the numbers fool you, it's not impossible to, uh... Man. We'll let him go. I'm not in any, any point to, uh, do any damage. We need to try and do some damage. Yeah. I need to run. I don't know if I'm gonna get away, but we'll try. No, 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 no. Oh. He's chasing. Oh god, he's chasing. Get back! Ah, uh, no! Okay, there was no hope. I mean, I, I, I couldn't get away. We'll stay dead. No, we won't. We're gonna keep pushing because this isn't over till it's over. It does, I think it's gonna take some time to get used to the tactics that win games in this. But for now, we're just having a look. We're just going to see. It is a gorgeous game. I mean, the, uh, the visuals are stunning. So I'm going to help push these guys back so we can at least move our troops forward into the point and hopefully capture it. Because it's currently neutral. So they're backing off. Okay, I've finally leveled up, which is good. And I actually hit my teammate. That's fine. But we can now get perks. So we want to try and get as much XP as possible just so we can boost up. Because if we can get my second level ability, I can really get our troops to push forward and do some heavy hits. And really fluster the enemy team. And that's what we're aiming for here. If we can pull it off. Good. Alright. So our team is now holding majority on this point, which is great. Previously we were not doing too well. We've lost A though. I'm hoping that our team is able to... Oh, shit. Let me see if we can do a block break on this guy because that's... Let's see what we can do. I'm gonna go for him because he... Oh god, this is dangerous. This is really dangerous. Okay. We missed out there. It does get really awkward sometimes when you get lost in a group of, of soldiers like that. It makes it quite hard to see what's going on. And um, your sword is affected, or your weapon, sorry, is affected by other or other players or soldiers and um, objects within the map as well. So if you're in a tight space, your sword will hit the walls and you won't do any damage. Uh, they're really rushing up, up on us now, so we need, to, we need to do some serious pushing. And just get in there as we can. Push these guys back. Now I saw that there's one of their guys. Okay, we've got okay, we've got my second ability. I need to rally. Alright. Yeah. Okay, we're in trouble now. Oh, they're chasing me. I, I'm in some serious trouble. Okay, we're down again. Now, I never promised that I was good at this game. I've had some games where I've done better than this, though. That's fine, I'm not afraid to show the world my worst. So we'll get back in there. Let's see if we can make a dent. Down. 
We need, to, we need to do damage because she's now on a revenge, which means she will do extra hits. And I can't block her right now. It's no. Nah. Once again, when we just thought we had it, but we didn't have it. All right, new plan: get at least one kill before the end of this game. Otherwise, we risk ridiculous embarrassment. I'm gonna push around and see if we can get C, because C is currently neutral. Which means, if we cap it, we'll make an impact. Alright, our guys are here. It's three on one. You captured zone C. Oh god. Let me go, please. Let me go, please. Okay. We're still holding on to the, the smallest bit of hope that we can actually get a kill. Oh, I've actually got one kill already. That's okay. Okay. Playing the objective is more important. I'm just saying that. I'm trying to make myself feel better. Let's get in. Let's, let's get stuck in. So we're breaking right now, which means if we die, you don't respawn unless we can cap another point. So I need to really push these guys back. But the problem here is I'm now getting double teamed, and that's going to be a real problem. But if I can capture C, I can be on... Okay, it's currently contested, which means I'm still getting chased by this person. I need to... Okay, there's... No, there's no way. There was no way. There's a two on one. So as it says now, it says breaking no respawn. So it means... Unless we can cap a point and re-rally our troops... I'm being revived. Oh, I was being revived. Damn. Very close. Yeah, unless we can push up and rally our troops again, I'm not going to respawn. We have two guys... Two guys left on our team. If they die, that's game over. Because they've hit the 1,000 point mark. Battle of the century happening right now. Well you done. Lost zone a. Okay. You captured zone C. I'm back. Thank you. Now, now's my chance to not make an ass of myself. There's an enemy up there. Let's take this seriously. So he's currently okay. He's on revenge now, which means we need, need to. Oh, I'm the last left. Oh, there's... There was no way. That was three on one. That's not fair. Oh, well. What can you do? We deserve to lose. And I ended up doing the worst on the team by seven points. Um, oh, well. Not my best game by a long way. But, uh, yeah. So, at the end of the game, you get a scav uh, scavenges the map for, uh, for different items. Uh, and at this point, I think I got a sword guard. And I don't know if it's any better. No, not really. Throw distance isn't that great. All right. Let's head back to the world map. And you can see that we've made no difference in the faction battle <laughs> at all. But that's all right. Uh, yeah, but I mean, that's just a, a little taste as to what, what the game looks like, how it plays. Uh, hopefully people will play better than me. I mean, we just saw that the other team play completely better than me. I let the team down, I think, and I brought shame to my faction and my household, and I am sorry. But that's all right. I'll keep playing. I'll try and get better at it. And that's what we're here, and that's what we're here to do. So, that's that. Now, I mentioned a contest. Now, I have three beta keys to give away. The beta runs for a couple more days. Uh, if you want to jump in and have a quick go at this game, maybe you're not sure if you want to buy it or not, um, all you need to do to win is leave a comment in the comment section below uh, and tell me why you think you should win it. Um, I'll select the best three in the morning or tomorrow at some point and I'll uh, contact the winners. But um, yeah, I mean, the game's, the game's quite good. 
so far. I am slightly concerned as to whether there'll be enough content to keep it relevant and keep it keep it going. Uh, I suppose the uh, the faction war that we have here on the map will be one aspect, but it depends how interested people are in that. Uh, and it does go more in depth than what I've shown, but um, I'll show that perhaps in another video. Anyway, if you like what you saw, give us a thumbs up and a comment and subscribe. If you didn't, thumbs down and a comment. I'm, I'm very open to feedback and I want to know, you know, how to make these better, what people want to see, bits and pieces, all good. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. That's been, uh, it's been embarrassing, to say the least, in that, uh, in that fight. I didn't I didn't uh, didn't hold my own too well a little bit disappointed to be honest that's all right we'll keep going anyway thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one see ya